Okay, you guys, we're at Kelly's house. We're looking at uh, replacing the air handler and AC. Um, currently, this one is about 19 and a half inches wide, uh, 43 inches tall. Um, I got measurements of everything from the floor up to the framing and then beyond that up to the supply plenum. Uh, we have a three quarter inch line set that would have to be flushed and recharged with the R14A refrigerant. Um, looks to be a uh, 20 kW heat strip that's in here. I'll look at the breakers and the panel too just to confirm that. <clears throat> uh, there's a, a drain pan that moves, comes across the entire uh, closet. There's a little bit of a cut out here for the water heater. Um, we do not want to get into replacing the water heater yet, um, but we'll just we'll take a look and see what we can actually fit in here. I think everything will be fine. More than likely we'll have to probably cut the plenum up just a little bit higher and raise this. We do want to be conscientious of the uh, electric strip heat being able to be removed from here as well. There is about 11 inches from where the uh, air handler starts to the frame here. Basically the, the space in between here is about 11 inches. Um, and then this is all the piping for the water here below that. She does just have the one inch uh, filter rack underneath and then the returns up top here. We want to look at adding uh, a re, excuse me, a humidifier for the winter time. We can look at putting that up top here and then removing the louver to get to the panel. Um, we do have to get either um, transformer and outlet or look at connecting it to um, where the outlet for the laundry is. So we'll take a look at that too. Oh, and then thermostat just sits right here. <clears throat> 